See it my way one presents The Blind Treasure Hunter with Shane Kubot. Hello everybody, I am Shane and welcome back to See It My Way. This is going to be another episode of The Blind Treasure Hunter. And guys, I'm on my way to meet Metal Detecting with Randy. I'm driving down the road here, so hopefully I can find them and meet up with them. We're going to have an awesome time. Guys, what are you thinking? Why people can't drive? <laughs> <laughs> I'm in the car with Metal Detecting with Randy now. And we're on our way to find some permissions. We're going to drive around, see if we can find some old houses and get some permissions to see if we can find some. So guys, I hope you enjoy this video. And please remember to go check out Metal Detecting with Randy. Hi. Okay guys, Randy and I got permission in the yard. Randy's over here to the left. He just found a cool find. and I just found myself a lawnmower modified matchbox car. That is awesome. All right guys, we'll keep on a swinging. See what we can find. Well, this is pretty cool guys. I just dug up a fishing reel. I don't think I've ever dug one up before. And it's, uh, Randy says it says Zepco made in the USA on it. That is super cool. All right everybody, keep on swinging. See what we can find. Here's something pretty neat. So I was digging around in this hole and I got a beaver tail pull tab, a nail, a tack, and this little buckle popped out. That's pretty neat. The little thing in the middle, it still moves. All right, everybody. I'll see you on the next good target. Okay, guys. Randy and I have moved to a new spot. We're at an old school that was built in the 1850s. And my very first good find in this permission is a wheat scent and Randy says, boy, it is crusty. He could not get a date at all. But it's definitely a wheat penny. All right, everybody. I'll see you on the next good target. Here's an interesting piece of lead. I have no idea if that was a bullet at one time. Yeah, interesting piece of lead. All right, let's see what else we can find. Well, holy cow, guys, this is awesome. I just found a Benjamin half dollar. It's a 1949. That is amazing, guys. You know, it took me 26 years to find my first Benjamin half. I found it earlier this summer, and now I'm on my second Benjamin half. That is crazy, guys. That is super awesome. I'll get some water on it, get it cleaned up, and I'll leave you guys an awesome picture keep on swinging and see what we can find. I just found a wheat penny and it's a 1912. That is awesome guys. I got Randy here, got a good set of eyeballs to tell me what I'm finding. <laughs> All right, everybody, I'll see you all on the next good signal. Well, this is pretty cool, guys. I think I just found a piece of an airplane. That is super duper cool. Scan around here and see if I can find the rest of it. That would be awesome. All right, everybody, I'll see you on the next target. Well, look at this, guys. I found a little tiny spoon bowl. Must have been from a little kid's spoon or a baby spoon or something that's pretty neat and it rang up high tones it must be made out of copper that is super cool all right everybody let's see what else we can find okay everybody check out this super cool relic this is a super old lighter it's falling apart a little bit but the top piece would flip up so i'm guessing this is probably 30s or 40s if anybody knows let me know all right, everybody, we'll keep on a hunting and see what else we can find. Okay, everybody, Randy's over there somewhere, swinging away, trying to find some awesome relics. So hopefully we find some cool stuff. We'll see you all on the next cool target. 
Okay guys, I found this interesting piece. I have no idea what it is, but it does feel super cool. All right, keep on a swinging, see what else we can find. All right guys, here's something super cool. It's an old shotgun shell and it's all metal. So I'm not sure the date of these ones. But boy, that is super cool, all metal shotgun shell. All right everybody, I'll see you on the next target. All right guys, I just found a buffalo nickel and Randy says he thinks it's a 1917. Once I can get it home, get it cleaned up, I'll get a good picture for you guys. That is awesome. I found a compact, but guys, boy, it was in rough shape. It was just crumbling apart in my fingers. So it must have been down there for a while. That's super cool, an old compact. All right, everybody, we'll see you on the next good target. I just found a wheat scent, and guys, it's a 1934. It's always great to have an eyes. Randy's reading everything for me. <laughs> this is awesome. All right, everybody, we'll keep on swinging and see what else we can find. I just found a little tiny bell. That is super cool. I don't know what the age of that would be. It's always good to find a bell like that. I've never found one before. <laughs> All right, everybody. I'll see you on the next good target. Okay, guys, I found this interesting piece, but I'm not sure what it would have went to. It really feels super cool. All right, everybody, I'll see you on the next target. All right, guys, I just found a really cool clock gear, and it's a big one. That is super cool. It's always awesome to find cool relics like this. All right, keep on swinging, see what else we can find. Okay, guys, I found something pretty interesting. I think this might be a button, but I'm not sure. What do you guys think? Is that a button? All right, we'll keep on a swinging, see what else we can find. Well, here's an awesome nickel, guys. It's a 1951 Jefferson. That is amazing. You gotta dig them low tones to find nice treasures like this. All right, everybody, we'll keep on swinging, see what else we can find. Well, guys, I just found some kind of old toy car, but unfortunately it's mangled. The tires feel old. I mean, that's got to be an oldie. That is awesome. All right, everybody. I'll see you on the next find. Whoa, guys, I just found some kind of super cool pendant. I'm not 100% sure what that is, but that is super cool. Randy's going to clean it up a little bit, see if we can get anything off of it, and I'll get back to you guys. Okay, guys, Randy says he thinks he can see maybe a shield and some kind of sword, but he just can't make it out, so hopefully I can get it cleaned up and get a good picture for you guys. All right, everybody, I'll see you on the next target. Check this out, guys. This is super cool. This is a old thimble. That is awesome. It's a little smushed, but that's all right. I got the treasure out of the ground. All right, everybody. I'll see you on the next target. This is a pretty cool piece. This is a handle from like a fork or a spoon. Hopefully I can get it cleaned up. And I don't know if that's gonna be silver plated or silver. That is super cool though. All right, everybody. I'll see you on the next sweet target. Well, this is pretty cool. This is an old cream shampoo shasta so that's a pretty old lid i can't wait to do some research on that all right everybody i'll see you on the next good target well this is a pretty cool find this is an old medicine bottle and it says mckay and p on the top that is super cool all right everybody we'll keep on swinging and see what else we can find i just found a weak penny and unfortunately can't get the date off of it that's still super cool. It's great to find some wheat pennies. All right, everybody. I'll see you on the next target. Okay, guys. Here's something pretty cool. It might be a piece of a uh, clock. Uh, that's what, after Randy was checking out, he thinks that's what it might be. So that is super cool. All right, everybody. I'll see you on the next target. Oh, my gosh, guys. This is such a crazy find. It's a pocket knife. And it says Lone Ranger 
high yo silver on it guys how amazing is that that is such a super cool pocket knife ah lots of targets here where we're at right now all right everybody we'll see you on the next good target i found these two square things with holes in them and one of them says r94 on them so no idea what these would have been too this is pretty neat guys it's a broken piece of a jeep and it says dino expedition on it that is super cool all right everybody we'll see you on the next target i found an old lipstick tube unfortunately it's all smashed that's definitely an oldie that's super cool though all right everybody we'll keep on swinging Let's see what else we can find okay guys here's a super cool find it's a trade token and it says good for one quart of milk wow that is super cool we are finding lots of cool relics today this side says something else we're gonna have to clean it up all right everybody we'll keep on a searching and see what else we can find mason jar lid unfortunately the porcelain insert is broke it says ha on it that is super awesome though guys all right i'll see you all on the next good target okay everybody here is the wrap up metal detecting with randy and i had an awesome day thank you so much randy for spending the day with me and getting some awesome permissions guys if you haven't checked out metal detecting with randy Please do so. I would really appreciate it. Okay, guys, here's all the stuff I found. As you can see, there's a bunch. I'm not really going to go through it all one by one. But some of the cooler things are the shampoo, that shampoo lid, shampoo cream Shasta. Uh, there's a, a shotgun shell I found that was all metal. That's the first one I ever found. That really cool milk token. Um, there was that nice thimble I found. Uh, the really cool bell. There was that super cool pocket knife that says Lone Ranger hi -Yo Silver. And there was the uh, really cool uh, lighter I found. That's an oldie. Uh, the medallion I found, we're not sure what that is. It has an M on it. And some of the coins I found, guys, unfortunately, we didn't get to keep everything. Some of the property owners kept some of the stuff, like that fishing reel and some of the wheat pennies. But the oldest wheat penny I found was in 1912. I found a 1917 Buffalo nickel and 1951 Jefferson nickel and some other modern change and some other stuff here. And guys, the coolest coin I found was this 1949 Benjamin half dollar. That is awesome. It's only the second one I found in 26 years. All right, everybody, please don't forget to check out metal detecting with Randy. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment and subscribe and remember to always keep happy